Okay. Welcome everyone. Is this one? Yeah, sick. Uh, welcome guys to some more Stardew Valley. Unfortunately, my internet has gone down and I actually have to record the video for tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow being Thursday the 12th or so. That's unfortunate. But, you know, that's fine. I don't think anyone will miss it. It's fine. Uh, to our Valley Jojo Mart uh, customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal pursuant to INIT L61091 Jojo Co. Amendment. INIT as in what? INIT file? The responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As always, we value your continued support and patronage. Morris, the prick. Oh, okay. Well, so that means that the top half of that thing got our map got a. Uh, up. But hey, look, our turnips are back. Oh, our parsnips are back. Let's go ahead and pick these up. Don't eat them, please. No, please stop eating them. No? Okay. Let's go ahead and just quickly pick these up. And we'll water our remaining uh, plants here. So our parsnips now we can sell for quite a bit of money. And I think we'll go to Pierre's to sell it because. Otherwise, we're going to have to uh, wait until tomorrow to buy all our seeds. That's not really what we want. So right now, we want to use our, uh, our money that we got from... Oh, we got some stuff. As you gain experience, you'll discover new crafting recipes to increase profit and make life easier. A scarecrow, for example, will prevent crows from snacking on your precious crops. Okay. Raising animals. Robin, the local carpenter, lives north of town. In exchange for raw materials and money, she'll construct new buildings on the farm. You need her to build a coop or barn so that you can raise animals, so build a coop. And we got our uh, reward for getting those parsnips up and ready, which is good. So, we've basically just done our first little crop here, uh, and that means that we have a pretty good, like, this, these don't sell for an amazing amount, but they're pretty good for money uh, early on in the game, so I'll be selling them, uh, trying to get some more seeds for my friends, uh, sorry, for my, my farm. I was gonna say, like, I can give this daffodil to any friend that I want to, uh, <clears throat> raise some friendship points. I'm pretty sure most of them like daffodils. I don't know any, uh, characters that actually dislike them, though there might be some. Um, I don't really know who I want to go for in terms of, uh, getting a relationship in this game, because you can actually get into a, uh, homosexual or heterosexual relationship, depending on, you know, what gender you want, who you're trying to get into. Oh, and my game crashed. Great. I could really go for a right parsnip. Could a local farmer help deliver one to me? Alex. So I'm going to accept that because I've got a parsnip. That's beautiful. Uh, it's Lewis's birthday in two days. Okay, that's good. Ooh, got some algae from uh, the bin. God, they're disgusting. But hey, that's what we got to do. <clears throat> Alright, anyway, let's just go around here for a little bit. We got about 40 minutes before we have to. Uh, go to the store and sell our stuff. And also talk to Alex because we want to give him uh, our parsnip. Just going to check up here, see if there's anything we can steal real quick. No. I still don't, like, I love this tile, but we never really see anyone in there. I think the kids play on it sometimes, but it's pretty rare. So, yeah. Hey, cool. Alright, it's 9 o'clock, 9 o'clock. Let's go, go. Yeah, come on. Alright, hey, Pia, what's up? What's up? Let me show you some stuff, though. Uh, oh, I need to learn how to not sell all of them at the same time. Okay, hang on. I don't, I don't want to risk selling all my parsnips and then not getting one for Alex, so I'm going to go to Alex first. Here you go, mate. Is that the parsnip I requested? It looks perfect. Thanks, man. So he just gives me some sick dollars. Uh, it's going to be a pretty good start to our day, I think. Let's go and sell to Pierre now. Hey, take more. Okay, so right left click was sell all. Okay, that's good to know. Alright, so it's the it's the fifth today. Um <clears throat> we've got plenty of time, so I think we'll go for a couple more parsnips, just like maybe eight or so. And we'll go for twelve. We're going crazy like that. Uh and we'll also pick up some more late game or like, more difficult to get stuff. So I guess I'll do some potatoes. Um we'll do eight potatoes and um, anything else we want to do? Kale. I've never actually done kale, used kale before, so I'm going to actually try that. Uh, yeah, okay, let's get some kale. Just 
like three or so, just just because I want to see what it's like. I've never actually used it. Um, I hope it sells for a lot, because if it doesn't, then we just got screwed out of a lot of money. Um, but hey, that's 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 unfortunate, right? <laughs> Uh, we don't have any slots right now, so we're probably going to go and uh, put our stuff back in the... I'm just going to put some torches around here. It's nice to kind of have a little bit of light when we're coming in, in the night. There we go. Maybe we'll just put one here under the bush. Put one here. It gets a little creepy at night. You know it is. There we go. Perfect. Now some of the trees are just floating, glowing, you know, randomly. <clears throat> no cares in the world. Okay, so let's do our farming for now. Uh, okay, let's put the parsnips here. Let's put them all back. Oh, we got them. Oh, that was not a lot. Okay, <laughs> that's uh, very unfortunate. That, that's fine though. It should be okay. Look, we're not we're not here for the OCD guys. Come on. All right, I'm a little bit OCD about this, but no, 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 don't worry about it. These two in the in the middle. Of it's nothing. Don't worry about it. Okay, let's uh, put our potato somewhere. I guess we'll put it down here, I suppose. It doesn't really matter. Three, four, five, six. Ah, oh, that's really awkward. Okay, uh, we'll just kind of do them here, I guess. Whatever, why not? Why not? But I'm very bad at organizing, as you can see. <laughs> I mean, the first time I, um, I played, I actually was so anal about it that I, uh, I broke my seeds, my cauliflower seeds, because they weren't in the right spot. That was a lot of money that I lost, so... Trying not to repeat that problem. Uh, let's see... I guess we can do... I guess we'll chuck them here. No, 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 we'll chuck them down here, I guess. Whatever. It's gonna be a pain in the ass to, uh... <clears throat> get all these things done, but, you know, whatever. We have a lot of crops now. This should be pretty good. Alright, sick. Now, what can we do with the rest of our time? So let's put this algae here. Uh, we'll get some daffodils, we'll give them to some of the... Uh, some of the people in the village. And I guess we'll just like, kind of slowly clear out a little bit of this place. Uh, mostly clearing away mo uh, some of the rocks and such, because... I don't really need to cut all the trees down just yet. I don't really have a need for all this wood. I don't know exactly what I would use the wood for anyway. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and start cutting away. Some of this trash. I guess we'll just start mining. You know, just get a lot of this, a lot of these rocks out of the way. I don't know how how it is, uh, how efficient I can be with this, but yeah, we'll try to cut our way down to the bottom. Oh, I just realized that I might know who the last two people are. If uh, if this is what the game intends for me to do. Uh, so that mining thing that we were talking about that uh, Morris sent us, that little letter, uh, that actually could be telling us that uh, the last two people we have to talk to are the people past that rock, so I'm going to actually go over there and bid. But for now, I want to go down here, <clears throat> talk to maybe Lear, give her a bit of a, maybe a flower or something. Oh, actually, no, we'll, we'll give it to Jace, because Jace is the best. Best character. Howdy, hey, how you doing? You can catch me at the saloon most nights. Animals are a great company, but I need to spend time with people as well. Or, well, I have no idea what she said. I just made that up. Sorry about that. I, I just stopped reading, and yeah. So she she's a vendor, um, money, but we don't really care about her just yet, because uh, we really don't get anything from doing uh, anything with her. Uh, because we don't have a bond yet, so we can't really look at the cows. We can just look at them from over here, but we can't actually have any in our... Uh, on our farm. Hey Sam, how you doing? You gonna do a sick, sick flip kit? Did I ever tell you we used to live in the city? There's a lot of stuff going on, but it's kind of noisy and hectic. It's hard to say which is better. Okay, thanks Sam. Oh, where'd your skateboard go? You, you dropped it? Yeah. You're, oh, Evelyn, hey. George spends the whole day in front of that darn television set. Maybe we should go outside more. Some fresh air would do him good. Have a flower. Oh my, that looks wonderful. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Alright, well, get out of your way. Hey, Abigail. Oh, get over here. Hey, you want a rock? Yeah, have a flower. No, don't eat. You brought me a present? Thanks. Wow, I just realized it's Friday. Sometimes I really lose track of time. I know, right? 
Technically, it's Wednesday for me, but we'll, we'll pretend it's Friday, you actual animal. Alright, let's head up, uh, talk to the boys up at the, uh, the guild, and we'll see if we can get ourselves... Oh, wait, no, we actually did the intro already. Never mind. Change mind. Lol. Hey, Sebastian. Uh, I don't really know you. Uh, okay, thank you. I, I guess? Yeah, sure. Why not? Oh, there's a, there's a bird. Get him out of there. Anyone in here? Hey, Demetrius. How are you doing? Robin has a hot temper. It's better to stay on her good side. Don't tell her I said that. <laughs> okay. Hey, Robin. Hey, Robin. Hey, how are you doing? You met my son, Sebastian, right? He lives downstairs. He's a little shy, but I'm sure he'll warm up to you if you're nice to him. So Sebastian's, like, supposed to be me, IRL, I think. Oh! It's a horse radish. I'll give this to Linus. I think he likes that. Linus, the guy up here, uh, he really likes it when you give him random food and shit. This is a great gift. Thank you. Thanks, Linus. Please don't destroy my tent. It's happened before. Okay, we need to leave. <laughs> oh. This is uh, the definition of a tragic character. Jesus. Let's get out of there. Alright, so this, this little hole thing is uh, broken out of now. There's a mine here that we can play Minecraft in. And there's this cool thing. Adventurer's Guild. Proven adventurers only. Oh, okay, never mind. Hey, a horse radish. I'll take that. Alright, let's actually dump these plant fibers. I have a feeling we're going to need to in a sec here. I'm going to also eat this horse radish. Um, my energy's kind of kind of low. It's 5 o'clock right now. And here we go. Hmm, says Molly. Alright, we're just going to meander our way over there. I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a dark place, undisturbed for so long. I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Here, take this. You might need it. Oh, we got a sword. You received a rusty sword. Hey, that's pretty good. Name's Marlin, by the way. I run the Adventurers Guild right outside. Yeah, we were right here. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself, and I might think about making you a member. Alright, dude. Thanks. Alright, so... Alright, so this minecart's out of order. This is a lift. Doesn't seem to be working, though. And this is a rock. And we don't have a strong enough pickaxe. So we can go down this thing and we enter the mines. And the mines are basically like the dungeon in this game. Uh, I'll explain to you how it works. Basically, we're looking to go down. You can't go... It's basically like hell in, in Crawl. Uh, you can go down, but you can't really go back up the previous staircase. Uh, actually, let's get our sword for this. Um, let's do it like that. Yeah. Uh, so we, we have to break rocks and stuff to look for downstairs, uh, but you can mine for ores and stuff while you're here, and you can find enemies. Now, I think that this early in the game, it's just, it's easier for us to just kind of smack our way through and dive to the dungeon. Hey, it's Amethyst. Let's drop this wood. Okay. Unfortunately, because we have such limited inventory space, we're going to be pretty much ditching about like 90% of the stuff we find here. But that's fine. Uh, we're just kind of here for the memes. Just gonna stay here for a bit. Hey, explore the mine. So they want us to get to level 5 of the mines. Um, there's an old mine shaft in the mountain small town. There could be valuable minerals in there. But Marlin hinted that it might be dangerous. So we're already on like level 2, as you can see. So we're not really too stressed about this place. Just gonna, gonna bump down. Oh, there's a slime. Um, just like in Crawl, these slimes don't really do much. Uh, if you fight them by yourself, you can get some random stuff off them. Uh, they can't merge in this game though, so thankfully we won't get completely destroyed by this. Oh god, please. You just gotta smack them out with this uh, sword here. There's like no damage, but that's cool. Uh, ooh, this is a tiger eye. We kinda want that, so we'll chuck the coal, I guess. I really don't want to chuck the coal, but. Earth crystals, yay! Alright, we just want, we kind of want just like the good stuff in here. Ah, oh, this is gonna suck if this has actually any good stuff in here. Alright, cave carrots. I kind of want cave carrots. I'm gonna chuck these stones. So, the cave carrot you can use to eat. 
uh, gives you a bit of energy, and we're actually running out really fast. So this early in the game, we kind of have no choice but to... Oh god, it's a blue slime. Oh god. Oh god. Ah. Alright, so, uh, yeah, this early in the game, we have, like, no energy to do anything, so we kind of have to, I guess, tap out after a little while. Just because we have nothing, uh, we can't really do much other than kind of just mine all the good stuff and then stay down here as long as we can. Alright, we're getting exhausted now, and god damn it, there's so much, oh my god, there's so much copper, but we have no energy and we can't eat anything here. So we have to tap out, that's very unfortunate. Uh, but hey, we got some really good stuff here. Uh, we can actually uh, donate all this stuff to uh, Gunther, or we could gift it to people. Um, yeah, I'm gonna just go ahead and head on out to sleep because I'm about to die. I'm on six energy. If I if I get lower than that, you're basically perma slowed. You basically go in, uh, intless or strengthless in crawl. You have you move really slow and you just can barely move, and all your swings take like a billion years. It's not fun, so uh, I have been exhausted before, like right outside my house, and it's getting there is like just a pain in the ass, so I'm not gonna bother with that. So that was good progress for uh, first day. I managed to get some pretty good uh, things. I guess I'll put the copper away, I don't really need that right now. But we can check the TV maybe if there is anything here. So there is a weather report, and it's gonna be clear and sunny all, all tomorrow, that's good. So we need to sleep. It's only 9.40, but we have to sleep. We're good boys. Alright, level 1 farming. Plus 1 watering can proficiency. Plus 1 hoe proficiency. New crafting recipe, scarecrow, and basic fertilizer. Fertilizer does exactly what it does in the real world. It makes your crops better. I don't think it makes them grow faster though, so... Hey, who's this? Oh, it's Clint. Uh, hi there. Good morning. I noticed that you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. If you want to get the most out of ores you'll find, you find, you'll need a furnace. Are you gonna give me one? Just so happens, I had an extra set of blueprint, blue, blue, blueprints lying around. Here, I want you to have them. Thanks, Clint. You're, you're alright, man. You're alright. Learned how to craft a furnace. Thanks, Clint. The furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for construction, crafting, and tool upgrades. I feel like I keep reading these wrong, but, you know, close enough. When you've smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make your work a lot easier. Well, okay, I'm heading home. Take it easy. You take it easy too, man. Alright. Forging head. Craft the furnace. Alright, we can do that. Uh, how, how much does it take to craft the furnace? 20 copper ore and 25 stone. We have, like, none of that. Holy crap, we have, like, 12. That sucks. Okay, this is a message here. Robin, here, I know that you there's a lot of stone scattered around your farm. If you have a surplus, you might consider having me build a well for you. Wells can place all over your farm and can serve as convenient places to refill your watering can. Just swing by my shop with 75 stones and 1,000 gold when you're ready for it. Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely do that. No. Why would I? God, you're insane. Alright, now I have this great little, like, three-tiered patch that's bothering me, so, uh, that's unfortunate. I wonder what we're going to do with that. But what I want to do today is probably break these geodes open because, you know, that's what you got to do. Uh, after watering my stuff, I'll break my geodes open and then I'll probably buy some more seeds to just fill up that little hole. Uh, I might look to gift this amethyst to the purple girl, uh, Abigail, because, you know, purple, purple. But no, in seriousness, like, the first time I gifted her an amethyst, I, I was just like, you're, you're purple, you'll like this purple, and then, uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna eat this pasta, whatever, it's fine. It's fine, guys, we don't need it. Saturday today, uh, who's closed? Who cares? Who cares who's closed? It doesn't matter. I'm just gonna go up here, quickly check my, my goodies. Go back down. Got the music. It's pretty good. I really hope that the music is uh, quieter than what I am. If it isn't, please let me know. I, I, I'm still really stressed about it because I listen to it back and I'm like, uh, I can't, I can't bear to listen to myself. All right, so we'll head over to Gunther's side. Uh, Algae. Oh, we can actually eat this. Yeah, we're good. 
That's disgusting. You just ate that straight out of the bin. But that's fine. We're farmers. We know we know what that's all about. We know that line. Uh, let's see. Can I run down here? Yes, I can. Cool. I, I still don't know what that is. Oh, I can block. That's right. It does nothing. It's worthless. Don't do it, please. We'll just go ahead and, uh... It's from Jojanet Trial 2.0. What? Get that out of that inventory, please. God. Alright, we're just gonna stand around blocking in front of Clint's house because he's an asshole and he's not letting us in. Hey, let me in! Mm. Let me in! Alright, there we go. Hey, Clint, how you doing? Shop process. Give me that. Ooh, what the hell is that? It's Nicolite. And it's... Clay. Right. Fuck you, Clint. You're an asshole. Anyway, just kidding. You're alright, mate. What's he got to sell? Oh, he's got some ores and coal. Alright, no, that's expensive as shit. No, we're not gonna do that. Hell no. Hell no. Let's go just give Gunther all this stuff, because why not? Donate. Here you go. You can have Amethyst. I'll put the cup of stuff over here, I guess. Uh, we'll get you a Topaz. Do a Necolite. And Earth Crystal, put that here, I guess. Hey, we got a new reward. What's up? What's good? Claim reward. Oh my god, nine cauliflower seeds! Holy shit! Oh my god, that's like my whole day's pay. Dude, that's sick. Alright, nice. I don't know what this clay's for. Get this shit out of him. We don't need that. That's garbage. Hey, birds. Get out of here. Alright, let's see, what do we need to do then? So we, we want to plant these cauliflower seeds sometime during the day, but we'll get rid of this, we'll dump this am uh, amethyst on Abigail, because uh, she loves amethysts. Kind of weirdly, actually. I don't know why she loves them so much. But we know that she does, because that's why her hair's purple. That's canon. I agree. Uh, let's see. Hey, Pierre, how you doing? Can I talk to Abigail, please? Is she in here? She's not in here. God damn it. Alright. Alright. I have no idea where she is, by the way. Uh, whoa, this is some... What the hell? Sandcastle? Altar of Yoba. Wait. No <laughs> way. Wait, guys. Wait, is this dungeon called Stone Sleep? Hey, Abigail! Ooh, never mind. Change my mind. Change my mind. Here, have this amethyst. Ab, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. You've already given her two gifts. God damn it. Hey. The fresh mountain air is nice on a day like this. I wonder if the frogs will make an appearance soon. Abigail, shut up. Alright, I can't give you this gift. I'm salty about it. Get out of here. Alright, so we've got some stuff here. Uh, we'll buy three... shorts, I guess. I don't know, just to fill up that little space. I don't really care too much about it. Can I do anything with this? Abigail, damn it, I wanted to give you more stuff. Alright, fine. Find them. Let's go into Harvey, see if he's got anything cool. Hey, what's up? It's me. Uh, okay, no one's here. They just let me walk in through the front door, I like it. That's some extra security right there. Alright, let's just hop on down this way, I guess. Hey, Haley. Hey, what's up, what's up? I'm feeling an urge to go shopping. Ugh, I wish there was a mall here. Yeah, dude, me too. Totally, bro. Oh my god, it's... You smell like grass. Thanks, Chase. I appreciate it. Dad's coming back soon. I hope he brings me some toys. This is such a small town, you can't avoid meeting everyone, Penny says. I wonder what it's like to live in the city. Hey, do you want this? Thank you, this looks special. Uh, okay. Well, that, I, I think that's good. Oh, it's the edgy boys. Hey, I'm an edgy boy. One sec, I gotta beat this level. Holy shit, they are me! Oh, dude, can I be a part of this? Dude, I wanna see. What? I didn't hear you. I, I'm busy thinking about something. What do you want? Oh, one sec, I gotta beat this level. Okay, well, we're just getting... Oh, we hit one of the cool kids today. I need to leave. I need to go over here. I can actually fish some. Oh, I heard a door open. Who's that? Who that? Hey, it's Shane. Why are you bothering me? I just want to be left alone. Whoa, dude. You need to chill. It's okay, Shane. We know who you are. You're alright. Hey, it's Willy. Wacky Willy. Ahoy there! It's nice to see young folk moving into the valley. It's not very common these days. Yeah, alright, I'm gonna steal your fishing spot right now. Get out. 
I am the fisherman now. <laughs> this is uh, not a not appropriate at all, but we're doing it. And we got a we got driftwood. I think sh I think we actually like driftwood. Nah, fuck it. We don't want it. We don't care. We don't care. It doesn't matter. Right, let's just fish. By the gods. You know, I used to be a, a real fisherman too. I used to be a really good fisher. I knew all the fishing spots, all the six strats that people would use. I know nothing of the sort now. Oh hey. Oh my god, I, I like little Oh oh treasure chest, treasure chest. Okay, so if you capture a treasure chest, you get free stuff. Oh sunfish. Look at that. We got two two coal. Okay. I respect that. I respect that. That's fair enough. We got a sunfish of silver quality. That's pretty good. Unfortunately, though, uh, because of, like I said, because of our limited spots uh, in terms of money, uh, in terms of sl slots, we actually can't afford to really do too much uh, fishing because we can't. Oh God, please, please! I'm really not good at this. No, God, I have no control over this bar. It's actually a lot harder than it looks because you're not con you're only controlling up upwards direction and it has like this gravitational pull thing. Oh god! All right, there we go. A chub. Hey, I got a chub too. Oh, that's that's dirty. Never mind. We're gonna get this channel. Hey, Willie, where are you going? You want to talk to me, man? Uh, okay. How you doing, man? All right, and I'll see you later. <laughs> what? Hello? Okay, well, okay. Come on, guys. Fish, let's go. There we go. And it's glasses. Alright, I don't want that shit anymore. Actually, you know, we'll fish until our slots are full. We've got one more left. And then we'll go plant these seeds, eh? And then we'll probably hang out at the uh, bar just to talk to some people. Because, unlike real life, I actually can be social in this game. Which is very rare. Also, I have no idea how long this video is, by the way. I'm sorry if it's really long. I would alt-tab, but I'm in the middle of fishing right now, and that's uh, more important. <clears throat> Fish? Hello? What? There we go. I was like, what? What are you doing, man? What are you saying? Oh, God. We s man, we suck. Okay, we suck. This fish isn't even, like, moving that sporadically. We're just sucking. Hey, it's a sunfish. 27 minutes. Oh, great. We can do, like, another day. Sick. Alright, let's go. I don't know, guys. I I, I just want to play more Stardew Valley. Honestly, I might just record these off, off recording and then just never tell you guys when I've been recording them. Because I just want to play this game. It just... Maybe it's not interesting to people, but I fucking love this game. I don't know. I gave away a copy on this game. Uh, on the channel for that 1k sub thing, just because I really wanted someone else to play it. I'm hoping that uh, whoever got it really enjoys it, because if they didn't, that's unfortunate. Alright, let's plant these little uh, little buggers. Put them over there, there we go. Uh, and I guess we can do some cauliflower seeds. We got nine, that's a lot. That's a hell of a lot. Okay, uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. We're making like a very crappily made Australia very soon here. Looks like Australia, if Australia was munted. Not that you guys would know what that means. I think that's a little bit of a weird slang term. Yeah, there's more clay here, I guess I'll just chuck that over there. See, look how many slots that we have missing. This, the chest has three times as many slots as this. That's so unfortunate. God, and we have no money either. <laughs> I really need to save up 2k for that uh that beautiful backpack. Anything we can steal over here, guys? Hello? Is there anything over here? Nope. Okay, invisible wall. I get it. I understand. I understand. It makes sense. <clears throat> Alright, let's go over here. It's only been six days in the game. That's crazy. <gasps> it's Jess. What's up, kids? Where are you going? Why are you leading? Hey man, <laughs> you gonna just stand here? How you doing? All right, he's just running. He's legging it. He's legging it. He's coming. All right, he's just running. Okay, that was very interesting. Can I just like block him again? <laughs> I can. Okay, we just messed with his uh pop thing. I hope that doesn't break the entire game. Hey Alex, how you doing? 
My arms are really sore, but that's signs of progress for a guy like me. I must have done a thousand push-ups yesterday. Oh, that's pretty good, dude. A thousand is a lot. It's more than ten. Here's Gus. Hey, Gus. Can't talk to you for some reason. Here's Leah. Hey, Leah. I love to decorate for the different seasons. Me too. Here's Pam. Pam isn't responding, but she's looking at me. Look at that. But she ain't responding. That's unfortunate. I like to make my own clothes, but it's not easy to get cloth. So Emily has a really weird spike. And it's such a long trip to the city. She's very pale. Hey, Gus. Hi, Demise. I'm glad to see you here. You're always welcome here. Alright, sick dude. Here's, uh, Marnie. I always see Clint here, but he won't talk to anyone. He just glances over his shoulder now and every now and then. Look at that sprite, dude. That's pretty sick. Alright, I'll take it. Here's Shane. Hey, Shane. He's not talking to us, apparently. Alright, we'll do one arcade game, okay? How about that? Uh, left, right, left. I forgot which one. This one. Journey of the Prairie King. Oh, that's right. This is the, uh... This is the arcade shooter. This is, this is, um... I grew up with this game, actually. Uh, back in 2016, when I was born. Uh, this, this game was released from the NES, for the PS4, and I was like, man, this is my jam. And so you can, you can just basically shoot stuff, and you can kill stuff, and you can get absolutely shit on. Um, but basically we're playing as the uh, Baraki Hunter that we were playing previously, uh, except this time we're actually not slow, and there's a billion enemies here. And I'm, as you can see, I'm just a badass, so I just, I'm just really good at this game. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm gonna press space, use this machine gun power-up thing. I don't know what that is, but I want it, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to grab it. Okay, he just left. Alright, I don't know what I just did, but... Okay, I just went invisible, I think. I don't remember our Baraki having that, but yeah, okay. This is what I imagined when we were playing the Baraki. Just like enemies coming from all sides, we don't give a shit, we're just shooting. Oh god, get the machine gun, get the machine gun. Alright, we suck. I think you can like I think you get an achievement if you win this whole game with no with one life only. Not something that I am uh aware of. Not something that I've ever achieved. No, we're actually doing pretty well though. What's this? Oh! Oh we're shooting! Oh we're shooting! Oh my god, we're so good. Holy shit, look at this. <laughs> it carries onto the next screen. Hell yeah. Ah, oh, okay, we... What the hell? Like, it, it lasted until every single... What? Three lives? Bullshit. No, RNG. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, whatever, that's fine. We'll probably just end this one. If we die again, we'll just leave. Unless there's something... Wait, what is that? Is that an ally or an enemy? Okay, it looks like an enemy. That reminds me of the, uh... I think this is the nuke everything on the screen. That actually reminds me of those uh, guys from uh, Legend of Zelda, the classic one. Which I've used to play a lot, actually. Um, I, I got pretty far, actually, now that I think about it. Oh god, oh, okay, we got murdered. Okay. Okay, one more, one more go, one more go. And we lost our power. Motherfucker, okay. We got, we got, we got baited, alright. We just had no choice. Alright. We need to try to make it so that we don't get, like, murdered from every direction whenever we play this game. Oh, are you kidding me? I have another life. Holy shit, this is gonna take forever to lose. I'm too good at this game, this life. Oh, shit. Hello. Oh, that's what that was. Okay, I get it. Okay, I understand. I can shoot diagonally. That's pretty sick. Oh, what's this? What's this? What's this? What's this? No! I missed it! No, I got stuck on the wall! Oh, let's use a shotgun. Hey, shotgun. Here we go, boys. You know, I used to hate... We're getting out here. Fuck this. I used to hate shotguns, but then uh, there's this, like, guy on YouTube that used that always uses shotguns. And I don't know, over time, I realized that I actually really like shotguns um, in, like, all my games now. I, 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 I used to, like, be a real assault rifle person, but when it comes to third-person shooters and such, shotguns are, like, just superior. I don't know why. What are we gonna do? Wait, what? I was like, we're gonna spend the night at the saloon, and then what? I forgot. Holy crap. Okay. That's fine, we'll just cut some stuff down. Well, I talk about more stuff about 
uh, Legend of, Zel of Zelda. I had it on the uh, Game Boy. But the funny thing is, uh, I actually didn't own it at the time. I actually found it on the floor somewhere. Like, someone had left their Game Boy, and we waited for like a couple of weeks actually to give it back to them, and then no one took it, so we were just like, okay, well, you can have this Game Boy. So I played Legend of Zelda on it, because it was the only game that they had on it. I had it in my own Game Boy at the time, because I was a rich kid. Um, but yeah, we got. I got some. I didn't understand it at first. I was like, this game makes no sense. And I just kept playing it. I've, I've never actually played it with a guide, though, so. Uh, yeah, it's really hard for me to understand all the hidden secrets and stuff. But I got up to, like, this place where there's all these uh, red and blue, like, sword, sword guys, and they just kind of, like, throw swords at you. And then after that, I couldn't beat them, so I just gave up. But it was. I played a lot of that game. I actually discovered probably, like, three dungeons worth of stuff by myself. I mean, that's not that good, I guess, but, you know, I'm, I'm a little bit of a noob, if that makes sense. You know what, I'm actually going to go hunting for some forest snacks. I feel like that's actually a pretty useful pastime to go for, and it won't use an insane amount of our energy. Okay, never mind, we're out of energy. <laughs> I changed my mind. we got none left, guys. Alright, we are starting to pass out. Okay, we need one... If we just get one of the pine cone things, we can actually just make a snack and then continue on with our day. But it doesn't look like we're going to get that. I really hope we get that, please. Let's go over here. Maybe there's like some some seeds, possibly. Hello? Someone? You know, I used to hate seeds, and now for some reason they're, uh, they're nowhere to be found for me. That's, uh, that's always fun when you get wrecked by RNG like this. Please. Please. No. Ah. I can't find one. Guys. Oh wait, there's one over here. Yeah. There we go. Hey, let's make a snack. Oh, we have a hut with Alex. Is he the husband that we've been looking for this whole time? Is he our soulmate? Oh my god. I'm gonna eat this field snack here. Look at that. Look at that ton of just free energy that we got. We're doing nothing but farming for energy. Look at that. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. So simple, so straightforward. It's 10.30. Um, I'm actually going to pass out soon, so that's a bit unlucky. Uh, come on, let's go. Where, where is... Where are the seeds? I need the seeds, man. Come on, man. Where are my seeds at? Where are my seeds? I can't see anything anymore. I am... Oh, wait, I see a seed here. Hey, we got one. Alright, that's good. That's good. Can we get another one? Just one more, just one more. Please. For me. Hey, I see one here. That's not a seed. Well, I thought that was a seed. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. We'll just spend some of this energy breaking some of the stuff down. Like I said, this is a very long-term project, so it takes some time to get used to uh, and break into our environment. And we're going to be doing that, so just kind of cut our stuff down. Hey, is there a, another seed? That's pretty good. I guess we'll just mine some of this, uh, these rocks away from the surrounding area, just so that we, you know, are doing something with the energy that we're going to be eventually wasting anyway. Oh, it's 38 minutes. I really want to record again. Oh, man, it's already 12. I need to go to sleep as well. Damn it. Okay, fine. That's unfortunate. But hey, whatever, we got it. We got a field snack. That's good enough for us. I'm actually going to leave... No, actually, there's nothing worth leaving here. Oh, uh, maybe the sword, if we're not going to go for the adventure. Uh, cause I do need, I do need a free slot, like that's... Oh, it does 2 to 5 damage, sick. I kinda need the slots, I don't know, I don't know, anyway. Uh, I'm gonna go to sleep, bam, easy peasy. Level 1, fishing rod proficiency. And we got 117 gold from the fish, that is nothing, holy crap, that is worthless. Okay, well, that's fine, I guess. Fair enough. Day 7 of spring, year 1. But unfortunately, day seven is going to have to wait until next video. So thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you all next time.